Hey superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel, Reviews with Sue. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and supporting our channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Sue and I hope you consider hitting that subscribe button. So would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, I have a product to share with you from Freedy. And if you want to know what's inside this box, then just keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's Sue. And I'm back. And I have a product here to share with you guys from Freedy. They are a seller on Amazon. They reached out to me, asked me if I had any interest in sharing this particular product with you guys. And I said, sure, send it my way. You're going to laugh at me, but the item that I'm about to share with you is a double layered toilet rack. I know, a toilet rack. Sue, what are you going to do with it? Well, you don't have to use it in the bathroom. You can actually use it in the kitchen, in your pantry, in your bedroom, in your office, because yes, it is a double racked item. So this is what the box looks like that it came in. You can see it says right there, a double layered toilet rack. It does come in black and white. It says in this box, it comes in green as well. But when I looked on the website, I don't recall seeing that. Now there's two different prices. There's one price for the black one, which is $25.99. And then they have a white one. That one is $27.99. Now on their website, if you decide you want to purchase this, which of course I'm going to leave a link down below in the description box, if you decide you do want to purchase it right next to the price of the $27 or the $25.99, whichever color you might choose to get, it says 20% off. So you can save an additional 20% off of that. So make sure that you click that little box because if you don't click it, you're going to lose out. So let's go ahead and get into this box. I'm thinking that there may be some assembly required. So I want to get into it first before I start going over it because I can't really explain it to you unless I have the item like in my hot little hands, you know? So I'm just cutting the box open. I have not gotten into it yet. And when I open it up, it looks a little bit like this. So yes, there is going to be some assembly required. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it here with you really quickly, or I may have to shut you down and go put it together and then come back. So let's see here. We've got, ooh, actually, it feels like it's pretty nice and sturdy anyways. So here is like one of the racks right here. And then it did come with some instructions right there. Now it does have some more pieces. It has some screws. Oh my goodness, what have I gotten myself into? Then we have another little piece here. We have another piece here. We have another piece here. And then we have this other rack that is right here and another piece right here. So I think what I'm gonna have to do, guys, I'm gonna go off stage. I'm going to put this double layered rack together and then I'll come back and show you and I'll tell you more about it. So I'll be back. Here I is. Did you guys miss me? Well, I missed you. For you, it was just like that. But for me, it was probably a good 20 or 30 minutes. So now I have my rack completed. Yes, it does have two tiers. So one tier is actually completely flat. This tier up here has actually is totally um, closed in on the top. And then you can see it here on the bottom. It does have like these a little feet right here. So this was actually intended to go on the back of a toilet. However, you can use it for many other things. I'm planning on using it in my office, but this is going to actually go between the wall and your toilet tank or the desk or whatever it is that the surface that you're putting it on. The measurements of this little guy here is the length is 12.2 inches. The width of it is 5.9 inches, and then the height of it is 10.4 inches. So I don't know, it seems like it's bigger than that, but if that's what they're saying on their website, then I'm just gonna have to go with it. There were a few different accessories that were included. They had this little guy right here. It actually comes off. This is actually intended to hold your toilet paper roll. However, yes, I love washi tape, I do. So I am going to be putting some of my washi tape on there. I know I have a lot more washi tape than this little rack here all, but what I'm planning on doing is just using like my favorites on there. Then it also came with these cute little hooks like right there, if you can see that little hook, and they just hook on. There's four of those little hooks and you can put them anywhere you want. So if there's anything that you want to hang or dangle, you can put it down there. Like say you're in the bathroom and you have this on the back of your tank, then you can actually like put your wet washcloth on there, or you can put, you know, nice fresh ones on there. If you're going to like have any guests, you can put your Kleenex on here. You can put all your makeup up here. If you wanted to, you just can use it any way you want to. Like I said, I'm planning on using mine in my office. If I didn't mention the black one was $25.99. They did let me choose. The white one is $27.99. And don't forget that I have that discount 
little box there. Well, personally, I don't. The website does. So if you click that little box, it's going to give you an additional 20% off. Now, they did give us all the tools that we needed to put our projects together. I ended up with an extra screw and an extra little washer or little bolt here that, you know, you screw these two together. So maybe that's if, you know, you need them down the road. And then it did come with our little tools here. So no, you do not have to go searching high and low for anything. And then they also gave us four of these adhesive little rack holders. So what you do is on the bottom of the rack, you can slide these on there and then you can stick this to the top of your toilet tank just so it'll give it a little bit more stability or if you wanted to put it on your desk. Now, I'm not sure like when you go to rip this off, what it's gonna do to your surface. You might have to use some of that goo off to get some of the glue off. I don't know, so please don't quote me, but I am gonna leave a link down below in the description box so that way you can check it out for yourself. I want to thank Freedy so much for sending this over. I'm hoping this is going to work out in my office. And guys, if I have any giveaways going on, I'm going to leave that link down below in the description box. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe. A like on your way out would be great. And that's all I have for you guys today. So please be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.